easy to overtake as soon as possible. Look at him, how close he is. He's practically in the gearbox of the Mercedes car. He's pushing him down this street. He's not going for the overtake this time by because he wants to use the DRS as in towards 23, 22 and 23 and off the exit. DRS now enabled for Nicholas Longy, but he's not using it. He's not using it, he's staying put at the minute. Is he going to still dive down the inside regardless? Longy holding back, it's a tactical game. And look at that down the inside. Shinaka Clay into the lead of the race from absolutely nowhere. We're going three wide down the street. Jarno Amir ain't giving this up. There's barely any room. We're going four wide down the start finish straight to turn one. Paraja still leads. And look at Amir round the outside of Longy. Can't quite make it work. Paraja holds on, runs a little bit wide. Longy, look at the switch back from Amir. Incredible. Side by side, he goes with his teammate, and there's contact now between Longy and Massive Sean. Massive Sean, Jake Perham's out of the race. Jarno Altmaier places his car in the perfect position to steal the lead of the race on the penultimate lap of this Grand Prix. Have you ever seen a more dramatic WR race than this? Absolutely astonishing. Altmaier leads, Clay second, and Ron Harnow third, and it's a disaster for Longy, who looked for all the while that he was going to lead and win this race.